this is pretty cool isn't it so i was pizza um a very well-known um artist obviously mainly from streetwear i'd say um mostly i'd say kind of what well, what do you say he's come from that group of luca and all those kind of dudes and other guys well who used to do a bit of artwork wherever it may be he basically um let it be known on social recently that he's got an official collaboration with supreme coming out i'm assuming this season or next i'm not too sure um i'm assuming next season other other music um this is the caption that says the following thank you supreme new york if anyone knows me you'll know just how special this is i made the triple box logo hoodie fucking around and has now become something insane first thing i told supreme is we have to do something real that gets everyone involved tap back into the streets and make this into exciting again 2021 is about to be the craziest year of my life thank you for everyone who supported me and thank you for supreme for actually giving me this chance and as you can see on the t-shirt itself it's the famous triple box logo design that um, um our pizza was famous for doing on the hoodie i think he cut up different box logos and put them all on one hoodie which was epic back in the day i think it was might have been on vine if i remember correctly and on the back he's got his signature um he's basically signature down the back 2021 uh written was obviously that mark and then we've got some stickers here and then i think if you look here i think there's actually an advertisement or maybe something a poster showing some more stuff that we're going to be seeing going forward uh there's advertisements for him and his friends you know posted up wearing some of the t-shirts you've got checkers here and a few other people dying around so this is going to be pretty cool going forward man I'm, I'm really happy for him this is really awesome to see and um it's cool too because i remember reaching out to us pizza this might have been 2014 2013 i'm gonna say around then when i was working for a very well-known art supplies manufacturer and ended up sending him over a few you know markers and pens or whatever so i'm hoping some of the stuff is still in his collection now at the moment that he's still using that'd be pretty cool to see but again this is a very legit and um awesome collaboration from supreme again another reminder right no matter how corny they get you know, mostly due to their fans it's not really based on them no matter how corny they get and how overplayed some people might think the brand is the great thing they do always i think personally is that they provide you know very what would you say um cult hero fate you did they provide kind of like artists right doing their thing um with an opportunity to put some money in their pocket obviously i'm not too sure how the deal gets structured with these sort of artist collaborations whether or not you get a flat fee or you get a percentage of the sales but regardless they put some money in their pocket and it also provide them with a platform um to kind of bolster their message and their works and who they are to a wider audience because for sure off the back of this is going to be the shirt element there's also going to be the lookbook there's also going to be the posters the posters on the street whatever street act whatever activation he has planned that he's mentioned in the post and i'm assuming some sort of video thing that they're going to do going forward so loads of points of reference that you can basically use to kind of leverage the supreme name and the audience to then use as a platform to build onto other things and that's something that you can't really be said for a lot of other brands and they really do dig deep into the archives whether the people are alive or dead they definitely go out and reach out to the art artists for sure kind of get the right to the you know sign off permission whatever it may be and do it the right way and i'm really you know that's something to kind of definitely be lauded upon they don't have to do it that way but they kind of go about it the right way in general all these collaborations and for the most part i can't think of many artists really who have kind of said a bad word about their experience and working with them in terms of what they've done some of course haven't seen a lot of day due to copyright issues and stuff behind the scenes but the ones that we I have been have been able to see have been um, really really good and well worked out even if it's just like them having people model right i think of somebody like a cyprian galliard from back in the day one of the og models for supreme from ages ago you know he was featured in the thing and i'm pretty sure that helped his profile as an artist and you know i even know his name for, to this day because of what supreme were able to do and put him on the map and that sort of good stuff so i'm sure those guys definitely feel a lot of have a lot of kind of good things to say about what they do and how they put on for artists going forward but yeah man this is pretty dope to see again um i would definitely say again i mentioned to somebody else our piece is definitely maybe one of the greatest if not the best artists of his generation to for somebody in a position to get this collab at this point in his career is definitely something to be um heralded and to shout home about man great to see great to see